basically I was one I was one this is a dangerous place but I'm gonna try and go feel it it's a, not a good area you need to be careful when you walk around this area and I I got frightened. I got scared to death. I've never been so scared in my life, you guys. Because the guys started reacting to me, videotaping and everything, and it was you, man. You just want to see this. Stay tuned. What's up, guys? Thank you so much for coming through to watch this video. If you like it, give it a big thumbs up and also leave a comment down below of what you think about this video. If you have not subscribed, please consider subscribing to my channel as well. In today's video, we're going to walk at this most dangerous place in Malawi. Before we jump right into the video, I want to remind you guys that Malawi is a cold, warm heart of Africa. This is because of how friendly are Malawis to everybody who visit the country and to themselves as well. So please consider understanding that uh, yes, regardless of the status of being the warm heart of Africa, there will always be that one place that is notorious. And we're gonna walk through at the bridge around downtown i do have some other interesting videos about you know chinese businesses in malawi please go and check them out give me quite oh guys this is where i need to yeah guys still in the long way right here and i'm kind of like in the rush out i mean very busy now around it's late we're now trying to to go back home just holding this <laughs> so it looks like in a long way right here rush hour <laughs> There's a lot of Muslims here. Yeah. One thing I've realized, too many Muslims. Like that is the mosque. Many, many of them. Trying to get to shop, right? It's a man road. Could be a big mosque here. Oh, I thought you could. I thought you could have found out. Hey. I'm trying to go to shop right guys. <laughs> Still walking around in the long way in the downtown the long way city center. It's crazy here. Mosque. There is another mosque. <laughs> Too many of them. The very same. One thing I've realized Muslims are kind of like divided here. Yeah, I don't know. There can be a mosque here and another one over there. Boy, I. Nanginu, you know. Ah. Do I tap on way by Oh, do you know Ruth Prince Pali? Yeah. Oh, so th this is the main, 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 main road in. Uh, Malawi, I would say. I think ShopRite is down there. Hey. Yeah. It's crazy here in Malawi, man. It's a busy city. This is Nilongwe, the capital city of Malawi. Yeah, the guy said Malawians are peaceful people and I believe him. 
kinda like looking for pizza. Looking for a pizza shop, Havana. Then the test, the test. Pizza shop, I need a pizza. I need a pizza, 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 pizza. Okay, I do. Yeah, a lot of Indians here. Most shops are Indian owned. Just uh, uh, Texas don't have any specific color. You see a car, it's a private, but then it's a taxi. Almost read them like Arcadia. Reminds me of Victoria. Please, madam. Yeah. I think this is the great moment. It's rained a little bit. It's a rainy time. One thing you should know about Malawi, it rained less and the dry season is longer. So from December until March, it will be pouring in Malawi. Until December again, the whole country will be dry. That's crazy. But it reminds me of in South Africa. Glass for Africa. Yeah, man. Unlike in DRC, we have two seasons in one year. Like we have a, I mean, two seasons of which two dry season and two rainy season. In Basically, I was one. I was one. This is a dangerous place but I'm gonna try and go film it. Stay tuned. Just need to be much more careful. Hey. And that's the pizza shop I'm going to go in and get some pizza. Stay tuned you guys. We are in Malawi here. <laughs> Yeah, waiting for my pizza, ready ordered. How much it cost? Like a regular? No, no, no. I bought a medium, which cost eleven thousand. That's eleven dollars. Back to what? My back. Yeah, guys. So we are just leaving. Really, we are now. We got the pizza. That's medium pizza for eleven thousand Malawian kwacha, which is about eleven thousand is about eleven dollars. You know, I'm pizza at the bazaar. That's crazy. So this place is called 
Malawi, uh, Lilongwe City Mall, Lilongwe City Mall game, because there is a game store there, mega store, a South African mega store right there, game. And ShopRite is not also far from here, if you guys can see that ShopRite. And it's in a different complex. Yeah, so now I'm gonna go catch a taxi and go back home. My home, which is Zalika. Zalika refugee camp. Yeah, a refugee in the city of Lilongwe for a few minutes. <laughs> Stay tuned, you guys. Uh, keep you updated on places we go to. That shop right there. So, come on, taxi up. Yeah. One. Oh. Okay. You can cross here, that shop right there. South African mega store also, and there is pep store as well. Shop right there. Mm -hmm. it's, it's late you guys, it's late, we need to go. I need to go catch a taxi to Zaleka. If I don't get one, I will be in trouble. Almost got bumped by a car. City more. Electronics. Oh yeah guys, so this is game right here. South African game. So think I just go. And it is available here in Malawi. Actually we found out the lot, the lot, the lot from South Africa is here. As from there, there is pep store. There's Galitos. Um, I don't know. I can't like thought I saw Nando's, <laughs> but it looks like uh, maybe I was wrong. It's amazing. This is a mall um, called Malawi City Mall. Pep store is just the very same as the one in South Africa. It looks like. Yeah. So we moving to the other side of the mall. Town. Pizza Inn. Yes. We don't know it.
Nico Center. This is Lilongwe, guys. This is Lilongwe. Just moving around and seeing how Lilongwe looks like the capital city of Malawi. I look up here, sir. So, love the palm, palm trees. Tendai. That's so cool, guys. Bridge View Hotel Accommodation So you need a shortcut eh? Using a shortcut But no idea Where are we gonna get? Yeah, just walking around. Just walking around and walking. So, shoes being sold alongside the streets. Just love the fact that nobody recognizes you. I mean, <laughs> just the very same. We are one people in Africa. I'm i I'm going to go to I uh, don't forget, forget about that. For a few minutes, <laughs> stay tuned, you guys. I'll keep you updated on places we go to. That shop right there. So come at your taxi up. Yeah. One. Oh. Vuke. A para ivy. A para fita o mundo ali. Where is mamãe? You can cross here. That shop right there. South African mega store also, and there is pep store as well. Surprise! Mm -hmm. Come, it's, it's late, you guys. It's late. We need to go. I need to go catch a taxi to Zaleka. If I don't get one, I will be in trouble. So, I'm going to take a taxi. 
Huh? <laughs> Almost got bumped by a car. I'm in the same line showing you the Africa you don't see on TV. We're gonna walk downtown. Very busy streets right here in Malawi in Lilongwe. Ah oh, man, cross your fingers. <laughs> My very first time I passed through. A very very busy like this. Openly uh, taking videos. Let's try it. Let's see if it's gonna work in Malawi. I know many places it wouldn't work. Let's try it guys. We do take risks. So from this I think it's a taxi rank. We easy manani up. I'm not going to tax this up in the way. I'm busy. 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 Mora fui para a França a ponjo de coaga, por ponjo aqui é de camati. É? Para a França, ele me abaixa o mu. That's crazy here. Don't know why. Almost everywhere in Africa, places like this are always like dating. Yeah. I think in Mangamu's halfway. Huh? The Zaleka. Zaleka. Ah, it's open. Maricala, sir. Yeah, we're going to go to the house. Yeah, we're going to go to the house. Yeah, we're going to go to the house. Yeah, we're going to go to the house.